Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Plague Incorporated Evolved uh, Blind. Well, we've lost yet again, and we're gonna try again with the bacteria, because that's the only thing we can do. Matt can... it's gonna be Matt and age 2. Something. Okay, you're a new bacteria. To when you must evolve. Where shall we spread? That was pretty good. The spread over there. But I think I want to spread through Central Europe again. That's a pretty good starting point. There's a lot of stuff to infect. It's a hub of, you know, of transport. Um, yeah. Let's start over here. But we gotta be, we gotta be careful over here. I have to get... Mm. Thank you. I have to be really careful with uh, my visibility. So let's go for water first. So we can hopefully go through to other countries quickly. Because, you know, in a perfect world, I mean, in a perfect bacteria, bacterial world, um, we would spread all around the world right at the beginning. And then we can slowly uh, transmit to other people. That would be pretty cool. Let's do air as well. Uh, the problem is, if you get too many... 50,000 border guards are threatening to strike and disrupt traffic in the former DMZ due to poor employment prospects. Korean border. Okay. Really? Disrupt traffic in the former DMZ? Former DMZ? Ah! Of course, see, I keep forgetting, because uh, Canada has annexed Alaska and uh, the Koreas are not actually North and South Korea, it's just Korea now. So yeah, this uh, this game has definitely taken liberties with uh, the timeline. Mystery still surrounds the decision to postpone the London Olympics. All right. Yeah, but um, I'm worried about spreading too quickly in the starting country, that's the problem. Maybe I should have started in a country with both an airport and a... Yeah, I think that's what I should have done, actually. Like Egypt. It's got two ports and an airport. Let's see. Um, let's do this. See, I don't understand this. You've got cold, you've got heat. Both are much more expensive than... The resilience. Create bacterial shell to protect against all climates. So, obviously, this seems like a better option. But I'm guessing that uh, since this is all around and only six DNA points, it, ac it actually provides much worse uh, protection than both uh, either of these. So let's do uh, drug resistance. And then we'll see. We still have not been spotted because we do not have only 32 infected. There we go. Now it's sort of picking up. Come on then. I need to go across the borders. Yeah, that was my mistake, I think. I need to start in a country with... Uh, with both an airport... And that borders aren't that important, really. So, France or Spain or United Kingdom... United Kingdom has two ports, which is pretty nice. Egypt is also quite nice here. Um, China has only one airport and one port. Russia has only one airport and one port for some reason. Uh, but yeah, I guess there would be too much clutter on the map if they, you know, put like a thousand airports everywhere. It celebrates the festival of love. No. Oh. Let's exploit that. <laughs> uh, transmission. No, I'm fine for now. Come on. Let's go. Spread. Come on, tourists. There you go. Tourists, go to Poland. Excellent. Well. Can we do anything else with transmission? We could. Hmm. Well, let's do insects. 
Come on. I need water level 2 as well, though. Has mutated the of the insomnia. I don't want the insomnia. Bloody hell, they'll see me. <sighs> Damn it. I don't want the insomnia. Less productive. Yes, go back to zero. <whistles> nothing happened, nothing to see here. La 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 la, move on. The problem is, devolving stuff costs DNA. Not much, but you know, it's something that you've paid to remove that you'll have to pay more to, uh, to get in the future. So it's just a double price, excellent, there we go. Come on, I need, I need to spread to other areas. How much is water level 2? It is uh, 18 and 17 for air 2. Okay, I could get birds as well, I guess. If they migrate a lot. I'm not sure how that's done in the, uh, in the game. But yeah, that's the problem. See, a lot of people announced a new aid initiative for poor countries, making them less vulnerable to disease. But see, this is the problem. I get so many infected in this country. I mean, in this country, this... How is this... They even took Switzerland in there. <laughs> yeah. Um, in this area, that uh, someone is bound to find it, and I'm not spread enough around. I need to spread more. And now suddenly we're gonna get, Oh, someone has found the disease. But we are co almost completely stealthy, as you can see. We've got no severity, which is... I don't know why they called it severity. Uh, severity. They should have called it visibility, like in the Flash games. Because that's what it is, I believe. Visibility. You know? You're this infectious, which is fine. Uh, you're this lethal, which we are not, because we don't have any symptoms yet. And this is how visible it is. You can't really find a disease if it doesn't have symptoms unless you know you're looking for something else and then suddenly go uh oh what the hell is this on the microscope look at that fully infected central europe but damn it i need something else hmm, heat resistance i guess i could go for heat resistance but i want this water transmission infectivity especially in humid environments and ship transmission 18 DNA points I need. Everyone's infected in Central Europe. Everyone. There we go, finally. Come on, give me some more. Sorry, if you see the game slow down sometimes, I'm just pressing 1 and then 3 again. Because I'm slowing down time. I think... No, I still can't afford that. 17 and 18. 17 for air, 18 for uh, water. Come on. Come on, I don't want to get found... No research has not been noticed. You know, the music in the background is... It's just general ambient music. Um, but it's mono. Mono. It's not stereo. It kind of sucks. They need to do something about that. Maybe it's just a placeholder. But even if it was, I'm not sure why it is uh, mono. Okay, let's do that. And then we have to be careful. Because they will probably find us sooner or later, because that's a lot of countries getting infected now. It's muted it. Rash. No, I don't want the rash. Come on, I need the DNA to devolve that. One more, please. Come on. There we go. Okay, now, as soon as I devolve this, I'm pretty sure that... Uh... Yes. Uh, that they'll find me, so I, I will have uh, wasted the money. But this is good. We're infecting a lot of countries. Well, I mean a lot of countries. We're infecting a lot of people, and they haven't found us yet. Seven DNA. Come on. Ah, there we go. Excellent. That's what I want. That's what I want. Excellent. You can see those red lines going. That is very nice. That's a very nice touch. So you can see where the infection actually spread via airplanes, via um, ships and such. No ship infections yet, which is very bizarre because I have the level 2 water transmission. I guess I need more of this, maybe. Let's do hot environments. Come on, let's spread. Yes, spread my minions. Don't find me, please. Not yet. 
I don't want to hurt anyone. I'm just a little bacteria. I know hurt. I just spread. And then kill. I mean, I mean, no, and then hug. Oh, excellent. Hello. Oh. Look at that. <laughs> Who would have thought that many people lived in uh, North Russia? <laughs> in the mo northernmost part of Russia there. Come on. Yes, infected ships. Carrying my pathogen everywhere. Well, we're still pretty invisible, so I'm hoping that this is the key. Keeping it really invisible. I'm tempted to go for genetic hardening, but I've s you've seen what the effect on that was. You bought it for, I don't know, 30 DNA points. It was bloody expensive, these level 2s and everything. And the research got dropped by, what, 2-3% maybe? It's bloody ridiculous. There's almost no point in C. I see in spending that. If you're at that point where you need to actually s stop them, you're probably already too late. Unless you're really close to, uh, to, uh, oh, no, that's already infected. You're really close to, uh, winning. Hello there. Alright, what else are we gonna do? Uh, maybe cold environments? Or maybe drug resistance too? How many infected? Quite a lot, actually. Yeah, they're, they're gonna find me sooner or later now. I need to infect Africa, look at that. Almost no one there infected there. Hmm. Pathogen avoids cellular breakdown in high temperatures. Increased effectiveness in hot climates. Let's do uh, bacterial resilience. So that should help all around. Yes. Go on then. No, no coughing, because I don't have that. Hello there. I don't have any symptoms yet. Yes. Keep it like that. Keep it stealthy. No symptoms. Someone is bound to find it now. It's all over the bloody place. I'm now glad the doctors only work three bloody days per week. You know, as per the difficulty level. Oh, oh, oh. No. I was just random stuff. Come on. Spread my minions. Spread. Okay, I need more... Hmm. Well, I need more heat resistance. Or maybe more transmission. We already have this. Maybe I should get more air. Yes, let's do that. Yes. Yes. Come on. Look at that, it's boiling. Greenland is bleh, bleh. horrible. I also need to infect Madagascar. Yeah, the problem is, if you panic and start going lethal too quickly, um, the uh, they will start closing borders and shipyards and airports, and you you will have lost. Okay, I'm going to save up my DNA now, because sooner or later I expect... No, 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 no coughing, please. No coughing. No coughing for now. Be nice. Play nice. Uh, yeah, sooner or later now I expect to be found, so... I'm going to save up... Oh, heavy flooding. I'm going to save up my DNA. Why is Canada... There we go. Madagascar, excellent. Um, I'm going to save up on DNA and then just go full lethal. Once I'm, uh... Really there, excellent. Go, go, go. Can I get not more than a hundred? I hope I can get more than a hundred. More drug resistance? No, I don't want that. Let's see if I can get more than a hundred. I sure hope so. But it seems like this will fill, fill up. And I won't be able to get more. In which case, I don't want to waste them. Uh, I don't really need drug resistance anymore because... I mean, look, I've already uh, infected loads of people there. But maybe I need more heat resistance. Let's do that. And maybe rodent transmission as well. Or maybe bird transmission. Especially in urban regions and mutation. Now let's do land transmission and mutation. Let's do that. Okay, that's enough now. Yes. 
Come on, infect everything. Come on, Canada. You're lagging behind. And so is Australia. Well, they're, they're going along there. Come on, Africa. Is it just Central Africa now? Let's see. Yeah, Central Africa and Algeria. Has mutated and developed the rash symptom. No. Well, actually, I have all the world infected now. I just need to infect a little more. And then... I'm just gonna keep the rash for now. They're gonna find me now, probably. But then... We can evolve into something seriously troubling. Yes. Go on then, in fact. Look at that infection going up like crazy then. Oh, not a lot in Central Africa. Or Algeria. But these were the last one to get infected. And Angola. Yeah, look at that. It just goes absolutely crazy. Look. Just boom, 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 boom. Of course. <clears throat> Exponential growth. Look at that. We have won the game this time. No one has spotted us yet, even though we have the rash now. Well, we don't have the rash. We cause rash. There we go. Rash. And uh, this is brilliant. And as soon as everyone is infected or we get spotted, I'm gonna start... Oh, notice very high levels of bird migration. They're worried that bird, birds could uh, rapidly spread disease between countries if they become infected. Yeah, that's fine. Has mutated. Coughing. No, no, no. Well, yeah, okay. I'm gonna leave it at that. Ah, uh, there we go. A new disease which has been named MET-NH2. It appears to be mostly harmless, but must be investigated further. I like that this actually takes your symptoms. So, if you have nothing, it says it's harmless. Now we're mostly harmless. If we were lethal now, it'd probably be a bit alarmed. Come on, yes, look at that. Everyone's infected. Well, will be infected quickly, yes. Threat level to, uh, for MET-NH2 due to extremely rapid evolution caused by DNA instability. Where's the cure? 2084. Okay, there we go. Finland's first to instruct doctors to begin research into a cure. Without greater funding, it is expected to take a long time. Okay, it's time to drop the bombs. Symptoms. Let's go. Cysts. Abscesses. Systemic infection. No, uh... Yeah, let's... Let's do tumors. Internal hemorrhaging, hemorrhaging shock, and then we'll do necrosis. Bloody hell, with a nasty disease. Maybe also sneezing. There we go. Now it's really nasty. First death in the Balkan states. Germany shuts down airports. Too late has become the first country to try, try and limit the spread of MET-NH2. Alright. The last healthy person on the planet recently became infected with MET-NH2. So, uh... Give me the most lethal stuff. Well, necrosis, but I need 33 for that. I guess I need deaths for DNA. Oh, The cure is really fast now, come on! Research doctors uh, are completely focused on developing a cure. Yeah, but deaths are piling up. Come on. I need more. Oh, please, I need... 33 DNA points. Oh. Yeah, I need 33 DNA points. Come on, come on, come on, come on. They're researching the bloody cure really fast. Come on. There we go. 33. Normal life in South Africa is beginning to break down. Let's see. Uh, general disruption. Come on. 33. Give me necrosis. That's really bad. And now the bodies pile up. Look at that. Look at all the DNA we're getting now for all the deaths. Has been placed on the RMS watch list. Canada has started to send research teams. Okay, uh, what else can we get? Skin lesions, immune suppression. What should we get? Let's get systemic infection. And then maybe immune suppression as well. Look at that. Oh my god, look at that. Everyone's dying everywhere. Oh. Dead. Greenland is first to fall into anarchy. Has mutated the skin lesion symptom without using DNA. 
Uh, let's do immune suppression. And then total organ failure. Look at the lethality on that. 37 DNA. Catastrophic cell death of multiple tissues types causes body-wide organ failure and rapid death. How's the research coming along, guys? 2017. What is the time, actually? Oh, 2017. Yeah, look at that world. Everyone's almost dead, so never mind that. Can we still do that? Uh, 37 points. Yeah, we can. We don't need to, but we will. Look at that. Everyone's dead. 71, uh, seven, uh, 61 million people left. Uh. Yeah, look at that. Research has gone up to 2019. And it is a high potential. Destroyed research, look at that. Yeah, they're gone. Humanity close to extinction. What a scary thought, actually. Look at the world now. They're still researching. It's an apocalypse. Has destroyed the world despite the world's best efforts. The last few humans know they are watching the end of history. Uh-oh. 4,000 left. Uh, zero left. We've done it. We have done it. Has successfully eliminated all life on Earth. Bloody hell, that was actually really quite difficult. But you need to stay hidden. And next time, we can now finally use a parasite, I think. Or is it a virus? I'm not sure. I think it's a virus. Alright. Thank you for watching. And I will see you in the next part. Bye-bye.